Goddard Carlson, the linebackers. In the shotgun snap, Gartrell up the middle, has a big hole inside the 25 to the 20 to the 10, five touchdown. Sanford on the board first from 43 yards out. Additional set, They'll give it play fake to the eye back. Empty open. has a man wide open. That's Via Lobos. Hasiel catches it at the 15, and he'll easily walk into the end zone for a touchdown. 33 yards from Emke to Via Lobos and Sedgwick County counters with a touchdown of their own. Watch the tight end on the backside is uncovered. Gartrell on a reverse, has great speed Gone. again. Look at him get to the corner, and it looks like he's going to score again. Yes, touchdown, Kelton Gartrell. 56 yards on the inside handoff from the quarterback, Josh Holman. Wow. Behind Emke, Parker will get it. Brady cuts he to the left fast. side. Good speed there to the 10-5 touchdown, Sedgwick County. 25-yard run that time for Brody Parker. I tied in. You talked about that being a key here. Emke wants to throw, looking for Heath, has him out there, makes the catch, little stutter move, and he'll score. Right on cue, Terrence Heath, a touchdown reception from Emke, 44 yards out. Cougars back on the board. They extend their lead out to 20 to 12. To the left of Holman. He'll get this toss. He's also a quarterback. He'll throw it. Has a man. Ball caught. Was it caught? Yes. In the end zone, touchdown. That's Ruben Chavez. His defense a chance to rest a little bit because this is a big play. Emke wants Open. to throw as Heath out there makes the catch, spins away from Gartrell, eludes another defender, uh -oh. tries to cut it back. He's at the 30. It's a pretty good block. And I think he's going to score. That is Terrence Heath on quite a catch and quite a run for the touchdown. Left knee. This is Fowler over that right side, charging forward, and he's in the end zone for a touchdown. So they'll shift to the offset eye. Emke has to look deep here. You would think got a man uh -huh. in Via Lobos in the crossing route. He is wide open at the 20 to the 10. Touchdown. Nope. Direct snap to Gartrell. He'll turn that right corner, and he got inside the cone, I believe. Yes, touchdown. Again, a quick snap. This is Emke on the counter to the left side. He has some room. He'll get to the corner. He'll get to the 20, to the 10, to the 5, and touchdown. Tonight, but he's been a factor as a sophomore, especially on the defensive side, but he's not in uniform tonight. There's a fumble. Ball scooped up. I believe that's Terrence Heath is going to take it and scoop and score for the touchdown. And we'll call it about 30 yard, 38 yards on that fumble return. Yeah, go to three. up a little bit. Yep. Now they go to three. Fowler again will try that left side. And they're just wearing down this Sanford defense. And Fowler is going to go the distance again. This one will be from 43 yards out. Yet another touchdown. Fowler is back at running back. Makes a nice one-handed grab on the little screen across the middle. And he gets back across the grain. And again, he's going to win the race to the end zone. And this will be a touchdown for Sedgwick County. A 50-yard completion from Jared Emke to Caleb. You say it fast enough, people might believe you're right. <laughs> Here's Gartrell again breaking through the seam inside the five. Touchdown. Good for him. Yep. Good for the Indians to get on the board here late in the ball. Game. And they are your state champions again here in 2020. Yeah, well-deserved on their side too, you know. Great kids, great coaches.